All right. We did it. No, I don't. I I'm actually really not high on Volley Bear and Trundle. I'm I'm, I'm really 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 don't think that they're good. Okay. Splice open Kiana, and now they're gonna we're gonna have EU GP again. So Gigabyte Marines are actually just playing for I guess pride at this point, even though they're out of the tournament. This this is like the worst feeling, man. This is what sucks. Like imagine imagine your uh imagine your is it Zin? Yeah, imagine your Zin Slay or Levi or anyone, and it's like you really don't want to play. You just feel awful. It's not that there's no nerves, like, so there's probably already thoughts like, okay, this whole roster is not going to stay together for next year. Fucking some teammates are probably already blaming each other. Why do you seem to disagree with nearly every draft? Are you just five head or do none of the coaches know how to draft? I don't think there's a way for me to answer that that would appease you. So I'm just going to, I'm going to remain silent. Hello, Chunks. Where are you going, Chunks? Food? All right, great, Chunks. No Vigar skin. Oh, you already bought it? Okay, good job. Okay. <laughs> All right. Great. Nardacuno. <laughs> Splice? Uh, okay, so Kiana first pick, get a Gigabyte Marines respond, fucking Kai Sinatilis. Oh, God. And then Splice respond, uh, Thresh and GP. Rise is actually such an insane pick here. Rise is so... It would require you to put Kiana in the jungle, but Rise would have been an insane pick. Oh, my God. Rise actually... Oh, 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 oh. Kiana in the... Oh, okay, okay, okay. They're, they're listening. They're listening, Pog. They're listening. Okay. Why is Kindred not even considered? What are you talking about? Kindred's literally fucking... She's right here. She's right here. And Duke has my stream on. Rise is so good right here because everyone on Gigabyte Marines basically has to go melee range. They're all close quarter combat, so Rise is just insane. This is actually really good for, like, the tanky kind of Rise. Um, the tanky Rise hasn't been very popular at this tournament. I think only Do and B sort of does it. Um, but the, the scaling on Splice is actually just insane. I can't imagine that they would lose this. Unless, like, uh, unless fucking... Uh, God damn it. Um, so, Splice. Mm, scaling is way too strong. All lanes are stable. They find a way to win. If they find a way... Hey, Ellis just All tuned right. in. What were your predictions for today's matches? Didn't see them on your Twitter. I find it funny how you say UGP always worse than KRGP, but Vizisachi has better statistics than every Word other KPGP around the block world. is that you have yeah. a massive crush on Xerxy LSXYZ Let kick. Me, okay, so the the 2G the 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 the, the two GPs at Worlds first off, one of them swords, so you can have him. Um, I'm not, I'm not even sure NA would take him. Uh, and then we had Gimgoon have a fucking awful performance, so congratulations there, buddy. You really, you really proved my case on that one. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Am I ready for another GP to lose to Fiora? Fiora doesn't. Fiora only can be picked on red side and against very specific team comps. Like, in in this game, Fiora should just lose. Should just lose really, really hard. Reset. Oh, I got a reset timer. Fuck, I, I missed it.
All right, ready? All right. By the way, guys, for those that don't know or you didn't see Twitter, Atlas will be joining me on stream. Probably uh, not tomorrow, but maybe the next day. So we're going to have the Pog State, okay? We're going to have the Pog State coming to fucking Twitch TV. What happened to Doron? Well, fucking... <laughs> sword, sword, sword made sure to that. Casting? Uh, well, I don't know what we're going to do, Sam. Sam, when do you get back to Korea? Are you here before I leave? Please tell me that you're here before I leave. Oh my god, Vizasachi missed the auto attack on Fiora. Otherwise, Zeros would be would be pretty feels bad, man. When was my date? Uh, I think the 16th. I've never heard that Trendemir's broken, because no one can bully him out of lane. And then his two-item spike is not balanced. And he scales all the way up. He's a scarier Fiora, basically. Because of the way that he gets to itemize. Nar's awful. <clears throat> Except for when Nardacuno's playing him. When Nardacuno's playing him, anything can happen. No, I'm not trolling at all. What's the best Trindamir build? Uh, Trinity Force Essence Reaver. You are fail person, IRL. I am lost. Ahmed the Rengar, thank you so much, buddy. I get it. You're in the middle of a Rengar ultimate. You're coming to my stream. You're looking for a target to hit. But all that you're going to find here is a need to sub with Twitch Prime, buddy. Thank you so much. LS is suck. Will Atlas be calling in or in person? Uh, I think calling in. Because he has a really high quality setup at his house. Why is Lucian not good? Because why would you ever pick Lucian instead of Draven? Because of his dash. Yeah, great. Learn how to step aside and pick a fucking team composition that wants to run forward instead of backwards. My god. Now, obviously, yeah, the dash can come in handy in some places, but you're not fucking picking Lucian for his dash, and if you are, you got a big fucking problem. Jesus Christ. Hail of Blades Pantheon, passive abuse, viable. I don't know what that even means. Alright, so, Fiora traded one for one in top lane, but Gangplank's lane state is actually really good. Essence Reaver, IE, Stinger? No. You get the 40% right away. What? What? You get the 40% right away. What are you saying? Why did... Wait, why... Why did GPTP? Oh, they're gonna lane swap. Oh! They're gonna... Okay. GP gets a Sapphire Crystal instead of a Ruby so that they can lane swap. Okay, there we go. There we go. Absolutely exquisite, exquisite gameplay here. So now, because it's a cannon wave, though, um, the Jinx doesn't end up losing out on a lot. And because Zeros decided to fucking go and place the ward, his recall, I mean, his recall should be canceled twice. North Karen, can you please check the brush? What is actual? What what are they doing? What are they? What are they thinking of themselves? What the fuck's he doing? Who cares if he's level two? Fucking whip him! Fuck off, Sky Prime Seventeen. What, what do you want? What do you want Fiora to do? Jesus. What the fuck? He's level 2 LS. He can't auto attack. He hasn't learned that ability yet. I love you, Sky Prime 17. Don't worry about it. Holy shit. Holy shit. Splice! What the fuck, man? I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose every- I'm gonna lose every single one after I should have had two. How bad is it if Splice loses? 
then it means that uh, J team can qualify, right? Group B is truly the group of death. Can Trin be picked in competitive? Death to viewers. <laughs> the group of fucking death. <laughs> group B is where League dies. Nice 10th anniversary. Can you imagine having the 10th anniversary and a ton of people get hyped about fucking about League of Legends? And then they're like, oh my god, the World Championship's on? Cool, let me tune in. I'm really excited about the IP of this game. And then you tune into this. You don't even know League of Legends, but you know that what you're watching is just not... <laughs> it's not meant to be. <laughs> Holy shit. Do I think Splice loses? I cancel it. You can cancel your bet. Up until what minute? You can cancel, but you get less back. That's so weird. Oh, that's such a weird... Th oh, like a buyout? Do you cancel? Uh, Jesus. I No, I don't know. Why did I change the prediction uh, of the Fnatic RNG? Tw I literally tweeted about it. What? Why did I... Why did I also... Why did I do, uh, whatchamacallit? Where is it? Uh, yeah, I did this, too. I gave myself loss. Um, does Challenger player usually smarter IRL than low elo player? Um... No, IQ and intelligence don't have to do with the game. Some of the stupidest people I've ever met are Challenger. Same in StarCraft too. Some of the some of the I don't I don't know. <laughs> Your teammates. <laughs> Savants one could say. Absolutely. Where's the ski? What do I mean by stupid? Um, I mean like, oh God, I guess there's no way for me to answer that. I plead the fifth. Gam's mid didn't finish first grade. Well, that's not very nice to say. Poor analytical skills? What do you mean? Honestly, Gosu is it what? Just because he watches AAR? Wait, he actually didn't? He never went to school? Wait, he never went to school? Game knowledge isn't more important than practice. I love you too, Strathan. You're Menza, but you're stuck in plat. So, well, I, I, I just said IQ doesn't matter when it comes to games. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 my fucking God. Oh, oh, okay. Dude, like, what the fuck, man? His family was never poor and he never finished first grade. Thank you, Paperface Mulgor. I think this game's over. No, I can't tell you good Trindomir players. Just look up the Chinese Trindomirs on Korean Solo Q ladder. 
Whenever, whenever you're looking for one tricks, just either find someone that somehow is able to get like top twenty EU West or like Grandmaster or above in Korea, and just watch their gameplay. Ranger Z is one uh, KLP Trindamir only. I guess top fifty is fine. Riot's plotting against my predictions. They absolutely are. Uh, Gam cannot close? Absolutely they can. What are you talking about? They have a fucking mountain dragon and they're gonna get an infernal and then they're gonna get fucking, uh, then they're gonna get, um, Baron. Yeah, thank you, Jumbo Bumbo. I just realized I don't remember the last time there was a female caster, what? For a game at Worlds? Froskaren. Ellis, uh, haven't got Riot script today. Uh, yeah, I, I didn't get it. Oh my fucking god, dude! Oh my god, my predictions are gone. Will I make a video about the new dragons? No, I won't because nothing's final on them yet. So there's no stats. No one knows anything about them. There's like I'll make a video when they're officially released on PBE. There's never a point to make them beforehand. GP is insane. Can I uh, pay you in Bitcoin for your tier list? I don't have a credit card. Absolutely, Deuce Vulture. I accept one Bitcoin as payment. Please elaborate on Fiora not being on the tier list. Absolutely not. Predictions are gone. Crab dance. What about the new brush alcove? The alcove, um, the alcove is really cool because I guess it maybe creates potential interesting TP plays. I I don't know. Yeah, yeah. The the alcove is pretty cool. I guess. Um, the what was the other one? Wait, hold on. What was the other one? Oh the br oh the ocean brush thingy. Well yeah, but we have to see if uh if that actually goes through. Stop picking GP. Wait, this is game number what game is this actually? This is game Oh, there's only one game left. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is there a way to have no tiebreaker? Splice would have to win this, right? If Splice lose this... Oh my god. Thoughts on Legends of Runeterra? I haven't gotten to play it at all. Uh, I played the tutorial. Why don't what? Why don't we see Nami in pro play? Cause she's not very good. Why don't you have drops enabled? What's drops? I don't even know what that is. Please elaborate, Renekton not being on the tier list. Keck W. Why does every analyst say FPX is a good team? They haven't had one good game so far. Uh, they never played an international stage and are currently losing to third seed EU. Papega Detective. I think I'm being entered here. I think this is a trap. I think this is a. I think this is a trap. I think it's a trap. Is Timo viable in pro play? Timo is on the cusp. Of being viable in pro play. No troll. He's, he's legitimately on the cusp of being viable. Teemo has really good itemization. And throughout the entire year, more and more champions have just kept getting nerfed. But he's still, he's still not quite there. If Teemo had like 50 more range on his auto attack... Um, 
or if his yeah if he had like 50 more range on his auto attack or if uh if he had like I don't know, m more damage. I think I think fifty more range would be enough, to be honest. Uh. Do you guys know Timo used to have fifty more range than he does now, and then they nerfed him? That was that was a long time ago. Timo used to have fifty more range. Same with Lucian. Do you guys know that about Lucian? Lucian used to have more range. Yeah. Fucking, you remember Pepperidge Farm, yeah. Lucian's Q range was actually fucking pog too. Piercing light. Hold on, is that MACD smash? <laughs> oh, welcome back. You ready for the four months or what? What what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Hello, hello. Mac D. Here to smash that subscribe button or what? <laughs> what the fuck? I like to read a lot of old patch notes. Go and look at Mundo's. Go and look at, like, uh, Beta Mundo or whatever. That shit's funny. He had an ability... That, uh, what did it do? It lowered the, the, the HP of all opponents around him by 33% or something. It was like an AoE. I think, I think that was one of his abilities. Then he had another ability that made it, and I actually really, really like this ability. I really, really like this ability. He had an ability that when he used it, auto attacks would heal him. For a short amount of time. Auto attacks and damage would heal him. Instead of damage him. I think it costs life. And then if he keeps absorbing shit. Isn't that the best? Ramus with full AD and Gunblade? What does that even do? How good is... Oh, my God. I've heard about stacking Sunfires. That's not, I, I really hope that uh, Lee gets a rotating game mode that is, like, classic lol. So, right now, inside of this game, Gigabyte Marines are up. Uh, fucking... They're, they're up. I can't even actually see. 4,000 gold with an Infernal and a Mountain. So this game is just going to be Gigabyte Marines picking up second Infernal and then getting uh, Splice. They hinted a champion that absorbs damage and reflects it back in the teaser. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the new Juggernaut, right? Why don't I renounce my citizenship? Yeah, let me just give up my, my American citizenship real quick. Thank you so much for your advice. Dank Dunk, thank you for 38 months. I remember you. You're a Darius player. I am watching the game. W Look, Twitch chat, when I start talking to you guys for a long period of time, it's often because we're in the lull state, okay? If you don't know what the lull state is, it's not the fucking Twitch emote, L-U-L. It stands for, like, the calm state, you know, the transition, all right? Like the lullaby state. So when we're in the lull state, it's time to kick back, relax, hunt for Twitch primes, Okay, talk to some people, you know, that's what, that's what it's all about. Look, wow, a lot's happened in the last fucking 50 seconds. Wow, the Infernal Dragon spawned. They moved to it. They're going to eat it. Now they're going to go mid. They're going to push the wave. Splice is going to try not to team fight. Jason and Lee are going to recall. Fiora's going to go bot. They're going to start Baron in a minute and a half. Fiora's gonna TP. Wow, great. Thanks. Thanks. Cool. Can we talk about stuff that's actually important? 
can we actually like go over some important matters right now? Like, honestly, I'm fucking like, can we can we talk about the really important things here? Okay. This is honestly getting a little bit outrageous. <laughs> Holy shit, what did revenge say? I'm fucking molding, absolutely. It's not the same meme every day, Big Black Teemo, but I love your name. Fiora 1v9 or kick from team fast? She has two items, she's already imbalanced. I just bet 10 euro on Baron Splice. Ready? Here we go. All right, here we are. They've started the Baron. Here we go. Wait a second. They gotta just make sure no one's coming. They gotta make sure no one's coming. And now we're gonna. Here we go. All right, Baron's disappearing. And it was at half HP. They get the Gangplank all out. Okay, they're going to back off. They're going to regen a little bit. And then they're going to repeat. You ready? Hold on. Rise is coming over. Fiora is going to TP. Here we... Here, hold on. Twitch chat. Hold on. I love you so much, Soichi. Like, I love you like... um, I love you like... Like a cone on ice cream. You know? Fiora didn't TP. Okay. I love you 3,000. Okay. This is S107. I don't know in what context. Alright, look. The script is fucking wrong. Alright? Unsure why Fiora is not diving GP under turret. The GP that doesn't even have ult. Sad sadder things have happened. Thank you so much, Soyochi, for tier two. I would have loved you more than anything else in the world had it been a tier three, but I'll take a tier, th you know, I'll take a tier two. No big deal. Lucian used to have 570 range. Wait, really? Hold on, my food just got here. I gotta open it up. More. Where? Where? Ah. Uh, it's really sad, Twitch chat. Chunks is going to army. It's all over. Chunks is leaving us. Alright. Alright! Saving the prediction. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Splice. Thank you. They're just going to let me know the fucking the PayPal right now. Another throw. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it truly is Cloud9 versus Griffin. We've come full circle. Wait, what? What did you cheer? Hold on. Double Infernal, 5,000 gold lead. Mountain Dragon, too. Who fucking, who cares about this? <coughs> oh, oh, oh! What? Dude, Corrupting Potion needs buff. I swear to God. All right, I gotta, after this game, by the way, I gotta gobble down food. Like, I'm thinking, like, I'm thinking he didn't use Tiamat, 4K Baron. I mean, this Baron is honestly a turning point because the double the double Infernal Drake is gonna really, really help out. Um, yeah, the, du the double Infernal Drake is gonna really, really, really help out uh, Gigabyte Marines, but they're definitely almost in a losing spot now. Especially while the Baron's gonna persist. Is this day three or four of my nine hour streaming sessions? I have never seen you eat LS. I don't get to eat a lot, Phil. 
I'm struggling. Okay. I'm struggling on on money. So I go outside as soon as the streams end with my with my fucking orange bag and I just I ask random Koreans for their Twitch crimes. You know? So 3k electric bill. I'm struggling out here, okay? Youngjin is so enthusiastic. Alright, I have successfully mixed all of my Jayuked up up. You guys want to see? Look, you see this? Nice. Imagine paying for electricity in 2020. <laughs> True. Any truers? So, Splice's Baron's not going to persist much longer than this. Humanoid has died. Now, this is this is really the game that you should have gone tank rise. I have no idea why he has a fucking death cap and a seraphs. I mean, obviously he can light everyone up, but he doesn't need to light them up inside of one rotation if he's just immortal and can't die. Especially because you have Jinx on your team and you have a Kiana that's already going to end up killing anyone inside of CC. So, you have, like, you have four carry damage threats on your team and for some reason he just feels compelled by the act of god to uh to have a rabadon's death cap even though longevity in a team fight allows him to actually put out more damage and it also pulls away from uh the ability oh my god uh it pulls away from the ability to pick him off or do anything like that have they never played uh versus fiora a lot of uh Interestingly enough, um, a lot of players haven't played versus good Fioras, and I'm not saying that Zeros is a good Fiora, I'm just saying um, good Fioras are very hard to come by. And then in addition to that, um, competitive teams that won't just randomly uh, fight four versus five is also really hard to come by. Just ask Cloud9. So it can be it can be a little bit difficult, you know. A scrim goes bad because you guys fought four v five. And uh, you blame the Fiora player, and they're like, we just shouldn't pick Fiora. It's too hard for us to play. Because apparently using your eyes and locating the minimap on your screen is a little bit difficult, but that's okay. Whoa, really? The director of Griffin was dismissed? No way. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There's nothing. What? Ashley Kang's Twitter? Where? Where? Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit. Oh, no. Wasn't show also the... Oh, God. I'm shaking. I'm shaking right now. All right, look. The game is, like, really cool and stuff. And, like, there's League of Legends champions fighting another. But where were you when fucking Chogyu Nam was just released from Griffin? Where were you? Dopa in. Doron's coming. <laughs> Doron's coming back. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is like, they're gonna fucking, they're gonna fly CV Max out to the world championship. Fucking Sword's gonna get, like, kicked from the team and stuff. It's like the return of Goku or something. We're on fucking Namek right now. <laughs> I don't even, I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> the redemption arc. I can't find it in new. Rising. What? Where is it? I can't find it on Reddit. My name is Kyung Jong Sa Sa Kyung Jong. 
Cool. First of all, I would like to express my sincere apologies to all the fans of the esports teams for their responsibility for the recent operation of the Griffin team. Above all, I would like to express my deepest apologies to many fans who loved Griffin uh, for uh, this event and to Kim Dae-ho, who had been hurt so much. Kim Dae-ho is a big contributor who puts Griffin up to uh, his present position. It is our lack uh, that contributes to the loss of such contributions. Also, as CEO of Still 8, I feel deeply about the seriousness of the situation as the domestic and foreign Griffin fans are already being punished. We decided that we could not postpone the still right response. Uh, through internal audit, we plan to hold responsibility in all responsibility parties, including the dismissal of Representative Cho Nam for any mistakes. However, Griffin's players are playing lowest professional gamers in the world on the best stage. Even if you are very distressed and frustrated with the current situation, we ask you to wait for a response until the players return to their schedules after Worlds. We actively... Uh... We're currently investigating Kanavi player uh, at Riot Korea, Riot China, and Kespa, and we'll continue to investigate. I apologize to fans who again felt a great loss due to the current situation. TLDR, they are dismissing Cho, and we'll deal with the situation with the players once their time at Worlds is up. They are currently investigating with Riot Korea, China, and Kespa. Holy shit. Holy shit. Yeah, save my predictions. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, woo! Thanks, I really deserve that one. Thanks. Fuck. Alright. <laughs> predictions inflated. You. Underrated. <laughs> oh man. All right, I gotta. Um... God. Uh. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me, let me gobble down food really quick. Okay, guys. I'm gonna. What What kind of music do you want me to put on? What music do you want me to put on? Hold on. League. Uh. Hold on. How about uh. How about KDA? Do you guys like KDA from League of Legends? You like Crab Rave? Okay. Crab Rave. No, that, that'll get old quick. You want Daft Punk? What do, what do you want? You No? Legends Never Die? Okay. Legends Never Die? Okay. Legends Never Die. Cool. 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 Yeah, we'll put on Legends Never Die, okay? Leg Legends Never Die? There's a bunch of no's in chat. There's a bunch of no's. Okay, how about this? How about this? How about this? Okay. Um, uh, Rise? Rise League of Legends. Okay, 